Also making news this Saturday, the prevalence of drugs and illegal guns causing concern. The Minister of National Security listed figures for the illegal items that he says are having a disastrous impact on the country and the nation's youth. Cleopatra Murphy has the details. Crime may be trending downward in the Bahamas, but Minister of National Security, the Honorable Marvin Dames, says the influx of illegal firearms and drugs into the country pose a real threat to the Bahamas if not curbed. Dames confirmed that between 2012 and the present, thousands of illegal drugs and firearms have been recovered by the Royal Bahamas Police Force. He says while the Bahamas does not produce cocaine, between 2012 and 2018, approximately 1,424.4 pounds of cocaine was seized, along with 6,856.4 pounds of marijuana. On average, 1,432.3 arrests were made for drugs from ecstasy tablets, powdered cocaine, liquid cocaine, and marijuana plants. From those arrests, Dame says there were 1,029 cases that saw 1,179 prosecutions. The shipment of guns and drugs fueled by an active demand and a constant threat is a constant threat to our national security and development. Our young people, whom are the future, are at great risk if we fail if we fail to take this quantum leap which would serve to to secure and protect the very culturalism of what makes us unique as a nation Dames was speaking during his contribution to the National Crime Intelligence Agency bill that passed in the House of Assembly Wednesday. He says firearms and drugs are having detrimental effects on the country, noting that of the 731 homicides recorded between 2012 and 2018, 602, or 84.4 percent, involved firearms. Of the 31 murders for this year, approximately 27 or 87 percent involved firearms. Between 2013 and, two, uh, and April 2019 of this year, approximately 1,486 pistols, 316 shotguns, 234 revolvers, 148 rifles, 84 imitation guns, and 18 prohibited weapons, inclusive of flare guns, baby guns, and machine guns were recovered by law enforcement. The Minister of National Security noted that those statistics are disturbing. The Bahamas does not manufacture guns either. However, the gun up epidemic is closely tied to the transshipment of drugs. Further, more often than not, small arm weapons greatly affect our incidents of homicides on our streets. Minister Dames contends that the country's geographical positioning makes it an ideal route for the trafficking of humans, drugs and firearms, adding that law enforcement must make measures to mitigate against the influx and its consequences. Cleopatra Murphy, Satanest Network News.